I call it dopamine dressing. That's the colour. Morning would be great, wouldn't it? That would be a great start. It's my boyfriends. <laughs> Gotta love stealing stuff from them. It's always the best. So remind me to never cut my hair again because I have no idea what's going on here. I kind of like low-key regretted that hot minute which I thought would be cute to just cut my own hair. So I finished getting ready now. I am going on a train to go to Collingwood and Fitzroy to start shooting some street styling. Loving this fit, gal. I spotted you from across the road and I was just in awe of the color to, to begin with. Thank you. So Thank what you. was your name and what are we wearing today? Mads. I call it dopamine dressing. That's the color. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> um, I have an op shop jacket that is currently being repurposed with some patches and wow. some stitching. I've got a vintage Etro shirt on. Mm -hmm. And vintage Comme de Garçon pants. Really old acne shoes and some fun socks my mum bought me in Florence. Oh, the pattern's cute. And a little uh, little hat from Brick Lane in London. Love and that. gorgeous florist bag by the florist guy in New York. Amazing. And these are just some glasses I picked up at Swap Shop down the road. They're some great. Let's then, talk about the uh, hardware happening the hardware. here. Loving the hardware here. Thank you so much. And you did your nails? I did my nails. Oh. Little Murano glass inspired <laughs> nails. Um, this is a beautiful local designer called Welf Bauer. He makes gorgeous sculptures, has beautiful exhibitions. This is one of his pieces. Love that. that was my grand's. Oh my gosh. Little, yeah. little family heirloom. Very cool. This is by a gorgeous woman called Erin Champion out in Torquay. Oh, wow. A couple of other family heirlooms. Nice. This is by some friends, Stetton Jewelry. They were local, now they're overseas. Yeah. They're fab. And then just some kind of vintage finds along the way. Same with this. Sweet. How did number. you discover about all these like designer jewelry? I'm big on to sculpture. Yeah. And that's how I found wealth. His stuff popped up through a page I follow from a jewellery company in the city. Detton was a friend, started um, making things at yep. home and I went with a mate of mine. Very cool. Love. I'm really into like a whole uh, masculine thick kind of chunky. rings. Chunky. and um, I'm big on silver as well. If you were to describe your own style in three words, what would it be? <laughs> I think you said three it before words. as well. I mean two words would be dopamine dressing. Yeah. Um, but probably... Vintage clashing patterns. Yeah. There's another three. Yeah, I yeah. Don't know. Amalgamation. If you were to trade your wardrobe with someone, who would you choose? Ooh, a style icon. Very good question. Um, oh, what's her name? That wonderful silver fox woman that wears giant glasses. Yeah. yeah and you always see her at New York Fashion Week, exactly. kind of things. Yeah. I don't know her name, but she's. I Absolutely. Well, thank you so much. Loving, Welcome. loving this style. Seriously, made my day. Hope you enjoy the rest of your day. Thank you so much. My name is Noah, and today I'm wearing most all clothes by me, basically. So, top of um, a jacket made from a velour curtain. Um, this is just uh, well, this is just an upcycled button-up shirt. Um, a pair of flares that I made um, with just a couple of pairs of jeans, some Doc Martens on. And yeah, just some construction glasses, my own, my own bag, and that's my look. It's kind of my uniform every day. Wow. Yeah. I can't even tell that it's a construction glasses. Yeah, I know, right? They look very fashion. It's kind of the reflection. Let's reflective. have a gaze on the side. Love that. Kind of All right. And what's the name of your fashion label called? One of One. I mean, that's only that's only a bit of it, but One of One Archive um, is the name of my label. And yeah, it's basically everything's one off. So. And it's good because it's upcycling as well. And if anything, we should be showcasing that more of. Main thing, I, I like to encourage people, even if they're not buying from me, encourage people to upcycle. It's like, I think it's a different problem, like you said. I think the way of the future. For sure, 100%. If you were to come up with three words to describe fashion in Tassie, Tasmania, what would the three words be? Drapey, big, and neutral. I Love think there's that. a lot of older people in, in Tassie. I think they kind of just wear what's comfortable. But it also looks good at the same time. But yeah, there's nothing too flashy in, in Tassie mm. compared to Melbourne and other I can states. see that. So it's, um, yeah, yeah. I think this, is a, this was a good spot for me to move anyway. And last question, actually. If you were to trade wardrobe with someone, who would that one person be? Lenny Travis. His style is like off the charts, Thank man. You. 
<laughs> nice, that's a good choice. So on the bottom we have Tien's, obviously. These are my new favorite shoes. I wore these like every day in Europe. They're just like so comfy and they look so sick. Yeah. Then I have like face off um, trousers. They're super comfy. This is just a basic top from Supre. So I ignore the fact it's from Supre, but I yeah, didn't yeah. want to buy the Skims one. Yeah, yeah. It, it looks exactly like the Skims. Yeah. Then this is just a, a vintage, like secondhand jacket. I'm not sure. I think my sister got it from um, Lost and Found. Ah, yeah, yeah I love that shop. Arcteryx bag. Yeah, <laughs> nice. The jacket's pretty sick because it's the got a little bit of a shimmer effect yeah, happening. It's like, and it's not like beige and it's not black. It's kind of like a silvery. It's silvery a mixture beige. of both. Yeah. So, yeah. Gotta love sisters <laughs> stealing stuff from I them, know, right? She's gonna be so jealous that like I've been stopped in her jacket. Oh, girl, I do the same. <laughs> and my sister actually like kills me when I do it. Yeah. And your little pooch here is adorable. <laughs> How old is he? 30 years, about a year and a half. Bless. He's on high alert. Is that a chihuahua? Yeah, he's oh a chihuahua. Oh my goodness. Adorable. This dog is my life. Oh my gosh. <laughs> well, thank you so much. Hi. Hopefully you enjoy the rest of your day. Yes, I will. I will. And um, yeah, have have a good one. Thanks. Bye. Lovely. Uh, this is from Alpha 60. Just from the outlet though. And then I custom, like I sort of took it in on the sides of by myself. Nice. <laughs> do you do a bit of designing as well? No, mostly just, oh, I just made my wedding dress actually. Oh, so. wow. That's impressive. <laughs> That's very impressive. Um, and then Uniqlo, good yeah. classic, wear it every day. They're good Shoes, for the basics. Nikes, again, wear them every day. <laughs> no way, that's um, sick. And then this I got as a present from for Christmas a few years ago. Very nice. The hat, this is a, it's my boyfriend's. <laughs> Gotta love stealing stuff from them. Yeah. It's always the best. And just for my own personal reference, where did where's the jacket from again? Sorry. This is Uniqlo. Oversize is always the way to go. This fits both. I buy things so they fit both me and my partner because oh. when you travel, you want to bring one or two coats. So, so you smart. I love that. Thank you so much. Like your style is dope. Um, Andy, I have a pair of um, Rick Owens pod shorts on. My coat is from a brand called Well Done. It's Korean. Uh, these scary boots are Dolce Gabbana. I've had them for a really long time. And Let's have a squiz on the sides. I thought they were ugly, but now I don't think they're ugly. It's got a lot of fur on it, and it looks yeah. nice for texture. Like a bear. Um, and I, it's, my shirt's cheap. I don't even, I think I got it, like, maybe from, like, ASOS. And Rick Owens. <laughs> like, literally. Yeah, the Dark Lord. I, I'm just like, if only my wallet would allow me to afford his stuff. <laughs> uh, yeah. I love it. My God, we got Michelle here. Absolute queen. She is rocking it as per usual. Hi. Loving this fit. What are we wearing today, Mish? Today, thrifted blazer that I got altered. Um, I've got my skins tank that I have in like 20 different colors because it's just the fit is amazing. I've got ASOS jeans that I've had for like five years. Sorry. Uh, Chanel little... Damn, girl. Ballet slings. Very cute. And Charles and Keith bag that I have been wearing to death. It's like versatile. Look it up. It's a, you can take it off. You oh my god, oh my god. Have it like... Oh, oh, hello. How are you doing? Good. It's been a long time. You well? Yeah, we just went into the Oh, I know. <laughs> Please, continue. <laughs> VIP over here. Right. Yeah. So sorry. Don't be sorry. No, we've got a VIP. <laughs> she knows the people around town. <laughs> Love it. So you can wear it in different ways. Yeah, Let's you have can a gander. Take strap off. Do it like that. I am. Oh. Girl, and it's got your initials on it as well. Love. And the necklace, lastly. Pemico, which is a New York designer. Dig. Ticket, so much fun. Cool. Always killing. Thank you so much. What are the odds we run into each other? Oh and I will see you at Fashion Week, girl. I will. <laughs> my name is Harriet, um, and I'm wearing a Romance's Born top. Oh my gosh, nice. Yep. And then I'm also wearing a lot of things from Sunday Social earrings, a Millie Savage ring, which Ooh, I love. Very <laughs> um, cute. Keys and a lead. Um, and then just random high boots. Love that. Do you remember yeah. where you got those from? They're very flashy. No. They were a gift. I think maybe Zara. Damn, good yeah. gift. Yeah. And the skirt. Is that the part of like one dress or? Dress. Oh. Like or not. So it's a bit of a style. And a bit of mesh coming and through there as well. It's cold still. Bloody cold. 
it's sick and the patterns on it are super oh, nice. You. My clips? Oh yeah, these are from Sunday Social as well. I've never on heard Bird of them. Street. Yeah. Yeah. Very cool. Yeah. Romance was born. I've shot their runway before in the past. I'm obsessed with their My super. Favorite brands and where do you do you buy it from their website or do you buy it from I like from their warehouse sales? majority of my pieces are from warehouse sales or online. Yep. And if you were to say who your style inspiration is, who would you say is your inspo? Um, probably no one in particular. I, I would say like I love the 60s when it comes to like eye makeup and things like that. It's something I've never changed. Yep. But I just love what I like and love. I don't let people say, oh you should wear that. Yes. Yeah. Love that. <laughs> And if you were to describe your style in three words, what would those three words be? Eclectic, comfortable, and random. Nice. <laughs> I love that. Awesome. Yes. Thank you so much, Harriet. Hope Thank you have you. a lovely day. Yeah, you See you later. See ya. What was your name and um, what are we up to today? My name's Neil. My friend and I are here from Brisbane. No Brisbane. way. Yeah. Sweet. Are we liking Melbourne so far? Yeah, it's been good. The weather's been good. Yeah. I've been, over. <laughs> yeah, it's been good. I've been meaning to go to Brizzy, but and right. I've met some like friends from Fashion Week. They're all like super awesome. I'm like, people from Brisbane are super cool. I'm like, right. what? That's what's it. going on here? That's it. That's it. Yeah, it gets a bad rap for sure. Um, <laughs> I love yeah. it. And what are we wearing today, by the way? Uh, from the top. Yes. Uh, this is from uh, Danton. Sorry. Danton. Danton. Yeah. Uh, this is from Cloak. Literally got it yesterday. This is from a brand called. Uh, Wee Moto. Lee Moto. Wee Moto. Wee Moto. Yeah. Sweet. Uh, this is from Nudie. Uh, they're just Adidas Sambas, I think. Yeah. Uniqlo socks, Uniqlo singlet on underneath. Um, this is from a shop just on uh, Brunswick Street. I can't yep. remember what it's called. Yep. Uh, that's from Malton Store in Brisbane. Uh, that's from my girlfriend, so I'm not sure. Ah. <laughs> but this is also from Malton Store. Oh, okay. Yeah. I'll need to give them a gander because yeah. I've never heard of them. Yeah, Very cool. I think that's it. Thank you so that's much. Right. <laughs> I'm going to move on to this guy right oh, here. Yeah. Yeah. Where's this lovely blue shirt where, from? Where did we go yesterday? It was... Um, um, like H-E-V-M or something? Yeah, just, it's, just, down, it's literally down just down there. I love how of... you guys aren't from Melbourne and you yeah, know more no shots idea, than like, me. Yeah, but we just popped in there and I just, yeah, I was actually looking for something exactly like this. Yeah. Um, and yeah, we kind of stumbled upon it, so. It's cool. I can't remember where it's from, where it's from but. Yeah. Love it, love the weight and the vibe. New clothes shirts, nice like tied up top. Yeah. I think these are just H&M uh, jeans. I think they're H&M jeans, and then we got the Reeboks on. So yeah, just nice you and guys, simple. You guys, killing it, killing yeah. it. Well, enjoy yeah. Melbourne. Thank you. Thank you so it. much. Thank you. And um, yeah, enjoy I'll the rest of your today. afternoon. Hello, loving your style today. What was your name? Uh, my name is Chihiro. Are you from Japan? Yeah. Where in Japan are you from? Mm, I live in Tokyo. Oh, yep, yep. Yep. And then with today's outfit, what are we wearing today? Uh, today's like, uh, usually I like the older clothes. I mean like vintage clothes. Yes. Vintage clothes? Yeah, yes, for sure. And then this watch is like Japanese brand. Yep. Yeah, the bag watch. Bag watch. Yeah, Let's see like the front. Like vintage one. Okay. But sorry, already not working. Ah, <laughs> so it's just for looks. Yeah, yeah. Also this one is like my ring. It's like uh, 1959. It's it like a vintage stuff, a US Navy. Oh, wow. And it's yeah. from 1959? Yeah, this is the 90s. Where did you get that from? Uh, in Japan. Yeah. Like vintage shop, I get, I got this one. Yeah. Yeah. Very cool. I like it. Uh, also this from Japan. From Japan as yeah, well. Yeah. It's called Better Fonte. Better from. Better Fonte. Better Fonte. Yeah, like it's like a newspaper bag. Ah, oh, uh, it's yeah. a newspaper bag. Yeah. Awesome. Uh, this one is like made from Netherlands. Also, the this shoes is like a newborn. New Balance, they yeah. always do good ones, hey? Yeah, uh, 1990. You've kept it very clean. Yeah, it's bought two weeks ago. Very yeah, fresh. from my friend's shop. It's What's your friend's shop uh, called? Up there. Up there? Yeah. Is it close by to here? Oh uh, yeah, uh, in CBD. Very cool. Have you been in Melbourne for long? Uh, maybe for a long time. What's up? Moving new house and then for a job as well. Exciting. Yeah. Well, congrats. It was super lovely to meet you. I spotted your outfit before. I love it. A lot of black, but you're rocking the black. What's your name and what are we wearing today? Elisa. I got this top. Where did I get this from? Line by K. 
I think they're from New York, like a brand, but it's kind of just like it's kind of like attention a to detail. Similar to like the store down there, base range, but um, this one's from the mine. And I kind of just love all like the outer seams and attention yes. to detail, and then yes. my skirts from Unif I got like a while ago. Socks are Aries. They're um, from my shop, the shop I work at. Oh, in yeah. Um, and the shoes are. Rowers, they're an Italian hiking brand. Very cool, yeah. and you're using it for like everyday wear. Yeah. And is that shop your shop? I've worked there with like um, a whole bunch of people. Cool. Like and let's talk about the hardware happening here. Ring, where did I get this from? Majuri. Love Majuri. Tom Wood. It's like some hoops. And then this one is. A gift. Cute. It's got like a paper clip happening there yeah. as well. Well, thank you so much. Hope you enjoy the rest of your day and work doesn't make you work too hard. Uh, this place, skirt, I think I got it um, just from Lost and Found. It's in Fitzroy. And uh, this is a Harley Davidson sweater, Depop. Love and Depop, Bryant. Yeah. <laughs> Love that. <laughs> um, this, I just like a basic um, leather jacket, also from Depop. And my shoes are from Nike. I love these. Shoes. Nike. Yeah. Nice. And I got these from China. Oh yeah. Very cheap. I had them like in five colors, different colors. You have them in five colors. Oh yeah. my goodness. Yeah. And they really go well with the skirts. It comes together so well. Thank you. Are you a fashion student by any chance? Yes. Or uh, yes, I'm I was... at RMIT. Are you enjoying doing fashion design at RMIT so far? Mm, I like making things. I like creating. Yeah. Um, yeah, I have some, a few, you know, complaints about the course structure. Yeah, girl, I did the same course, so uh, trust me, I know yeah. the feeling. Yeah, I'm enjoying it so far. Yeah, what is the one thing that you're looking forward um, to after you graduate from I fashion know, design? I'm looking forward to do all the projects I've like sketched up in my sketchbook. Um, look, can we have a look at some oh, of the yeah. sketches? I still have quite a lot of stuff in it. Yeah. Amazing. Yeah. yeah. Cool. Thank you so much. Enjoy the rest of your day. You too. Guys, I am done for the day. I have done so much walking. The good thing is I definitely got my steps up. But yeah, I'm pretty happy with today's outcome. I hope you guys enjoyed watching today's video. And until next time.